Baseball is back and Chicago Cubs fan Luke Donald is feeling it. The Englishman with a walk off birdie to take a share of the lead. Web gems galore between Luke Donald and Graham Dillette both going low again Friday. We also had more Gators and more walk offs in round two of the RBC Heritage. Mark Leishman was just minding his own business and hitting his tee shot on six when, wait, whoa, that Gator, he was minding his own business too. And here is how you get away from those Gators quickly. Adam Hadwin with a walk off chip in for Eagle. A few holes before, Hadwin decided it was time for a little spring cleaning this Easter weekend. Adam had one first in, in one putts. Mr. 59 with the 56 footer. Yeah. Oh, look at this. Oh. Sensational putt from Adam Hadwin. Having a good Friday, Adam? Graham Dillette sure was. He also shot a 67 in the morning. Both him and co leader Donald have carded rounds of 65 and 67, respectively. The two have combined for 19 birdies, two eagles, and just three bogeys in the first two days here at Harbortown. Dillette leads the field in strokes gained approach to the green, but it also helps when you follow through and make putts like this for birdie. Or if you make a 41 footer for birdie to move inside the cut line. Well, oh, right. you knew it. I did you not. knew that. Right on cue though. Did you know that Harbortown has the beef? Well, now you do. Check out Andrew Beef Johnston's dialed in approach on 16. Meanwhile, Brandon Grace had tricks up his sleeve, nearly hitting the ball backward to orchestrate this gorgeous chip on the six. And how about that roll? Ooh. As I said, it's an easy shot. Yeah, but he, he, I didn't think he was going to do tricks with it. Yeah. The cut line was set at one under in Hilton Head Friday, so keep up with the RBC Heritage on the PGA Tour social media platforms this weekend, and I'll see you Saturday night for the takeaway.